Hey, what up, family? How you guys doing today? Basically, what I got for you, lads, is 10 hidden features most players don't know in Grand Theft Auto 5. And I gotta say, some of this stuff will go ahead and impress you, and hopefully you guys can use this next time you hop on GTA Online. My goal for today's video is to show you at least one brand new thing. But if it's cool with you, real quick, I was just wondering, like, can we get this video to exactly 777 and blue thumbs up? I want it to be that exact like goal do not go over that like button goal i just want exactly 777 likes that's all i asked for and if you guys can keep it there that'll be pretty cool dude i'm not gonna lie that'll be pretty cool and as well please don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new and do not forget to turn on notifications so you guys never miss out any of my videos man we we'll appreciate it but without further ado let's get started so make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to the homie gamer dude he was nice enough to provide me the clips in today's video and i would appreciate if you guys go ahead and check out his channel it'll be all the way in the description go ahead and subscribe to my my brother right here he's absolutely awesome would really appreciate it and let's go ahead and get started with the very first thing we got all right guys so the first thing that we're going to be showcasing right here is a very weird animation glitch that you can't normally do without actually breaking the game so all you guys want to go ahead and do is get yourself a van just like this one get your friend to go all the way in the back and then what you want him to do is actually start smoking now once he actually starts smoking all you want to go ahead and do is go to your little interaction menu right there and press on empty personal vehicle make sure you guys go ahead and press that a couple of times and then you guys you guys are gonna see right there that the, the guy actually gets out and he's like floating it looks really really weird and unnatural here i'm gonna go ahead and showcase it again there we got it the character starts floating for a bit and that looks very freaking weird i gotta go ahead and say so if you want to go ahead and test it out with your friend it is currently working the second thing that we actually got right here is kind of cool actually you can like change the color of the rp bar and as well as the weapon wheel now all you guys want to go ahead and do is go to one of these stunt uh races right here they're everywhere on the map right here we're going to be using stunt h2o for example and then once you get to get to the lobby just go ahead and exit and just wait a couple of seconds until the game transport you back to your original lobby and you're going to notice when you guys get back to your uh, character if you go to your weapon wheel right here and as well as the rp bar you're going to notice that it's the same exact color as the blimp of the stunt race that we just did so it was pink and now the bar right here is actually pink and that's kind of cool because we actually always see it as blue but now this is the way how you can actually change it i'm pretty sure you can do it with other colors of the stunt blimps uh all you guys need to go ahead and do is just find the color that you want but we're just using pink as an example pretty cool actually now moving on forward towards the other thing that we got right here is a way on how you can actually get your gta online character to run a little bit more faster so all you want to go ahead and do first is go towards single player and then activate the cheat code which is super jump and the running fast cheat code as well and then just play around with it for a couple of minutes right here this for like about two and then you're gonna notice that your character is just all going crazy right here but anywho all you want to go ahead and do next is go towards the online tab and start a closed friend session or an invite only session and you're going to notice that your character is going to be running a little bit more faster than he usually does now as you guys can see right here the character is going very very fast compared to how you normally run so if you guys want to play a game where you're running a little bit more faster or if you just don't feel like going ahead and just walking normal speed then this is a very excellent way to actually do it it's pretty cool it actually still works and if you guys want to run around the map just using this this will work just fine all right now speaking of very fast there's a way on how you can actually get your vehicle right here the hydra to go a little bit more faster and you guys won't believe it but in, in, in actual hover mode it's a little bit more faster than the one that uh the, the jet mode that actually goes up way more faster so all you guys need to go ahead and do is actually go to hover mode and then you want to break the vehicle and then accelerate it by going up and down just like how i'm doing right here and you're going to notice that even though my friend is not in hover mode i am still going 
like much more faster than him like way more faster than him and you can do and you can actually do this for like races and stuff which is pretty cool we're gonna be showcasing right here i'm actually in jet mode you know just doing my thing he's in hover mode and by him braking and accelerating and braking and accelerating you guys are gonna notice the speed difference right here it's really really cool actually so now you guys don't have to go ahead and just use your jet normally you can just use the hover mode and you can be a lot of people actually doing this and it's actually really really awesome and a very cool neat trick that i'm pretty sure you guys want to go ahead and know about so moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here is another glitch but this one's not really that big but it's kind of funny actually so all you want to go ahead and do is get you and your friend to get in front of a mirror right here and then if you guys actually go ahead and press on enable passive mode you're gonna notice that your friend is gonna just like disappear which is a very weird visual glitch and you can just go ahead and take a picture and show it to your friend and stuff because that's something that's not supposed to happen actually again i know it's not a, something like a big big deal but i thought i'd just throw it out there just in case you guys want to play around with your friend you know using this because it is kind of funny now moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here is going to be a very very simple launch glitch so all you guys want to go ahead and do is get yourself one of these vehicles right here nice little simple plane and go and walk in front of the propeller so if you guys do this very very carefully uh you're gonna notice that your character is just gonna launch itself up in the air like that now don't get too close just stand right next to it just like right here and your character is just gonna launch itself you don't want to walk towards it because of course you're gonna get hurt and possibly die but if you just stand right in front of it then the hitbox of the blade will go ahead and force you to move aside it's very funny and easy to actually do i believe you can actually do this with a motorcycle and you can just launch yourself way more further uh let me know how that turns out for you guys now moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here is going to be a very very funny animation glitch so get your friend to get himself a motorcycle and all you need to actually do is just use this simple ladder right there it's right next to the hospital so make sure you guys go towards the location i just showed so if you guys climb on top of the ladder right here and you get your friend to grab his uh, motorcycle and just back up a little bit you're going to notice that your character is literally just hovering hovering up in the air like that and that's very very weird and i believe that's not supposed to happen but just go ahead and try it out and see how that turns out for you all right guys moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here it's going to be a very simple wall bridge all the way here at the airport so if you guys want to go ahead and hide from the cops or just kill them and stuff then all you guys need to go ahead and do is just make your way towards this exact location and mind you you have to be somewhat decent of parkouring because it is kind of tricky but i suggest for you guys to just aim out uh using your weapon right here to make it a little bit more easy so once you guys get to this spot right here just go ahead and you want to make your way very slightly towards this spot and you want to roll and you're going to be inside the building right here it's pretty cool you can actually shoot people outside of it you can troll people and since a lot of folks like to go ahead and make their way towards the airport then you can just go ahead and kill them or just troll your friends and do whatever you want right here i'm just showcasing that i can actually shoot out of it so uh make sure you use this uh you know uh, in a way where you're not you're not a dick and killing random people all the time you know just just use it for the cops and stuff uh yeah that, that's pretty cool anyways moving on forward towards the next thing that we got right here it's going to be a very very simple glitch and all you guys need to go ahead and do is make your way towards mortar wars one now when you actually play this mission right here there's like a pretty cool outfit that you can only get if you play this mission now that's kind of sad because it looks really cool and i'm pretty sure you guys want it well by doing this glitch you guys will now acquire it very easily so once you guys uh are inside the cargo bob right here all you guys want to go ahead and do is make your way towards a building like on the rooftop now if you make your way towards the ground then you won't be able to actually complete the glitch just make your way towards any building doesn't really matter and then go towards your interaction menu and then when you go towards illuminating closing you guys want to keep going towards the right just keep doing this again and again and again for about uh i don't know for a while like 30 seconds or so just like how i did right here and then after you guys just stop you're going to notice that 
uh, you're gonna be kicked out the game eventually. Now, by what I mean by that is you just wanna go AFK, do not press anything whatsoever, and eventually the game will go ahead and kick you out. It's very simple, right here, I got the alert screen, I got kicked out, and then once you guys make your way back towards an online session, you're going to continue having the outfit. So make sure you guys go ahead and save it as an outfit so you guys don't lose it, and you can go ahead and keep it forever. Very cool costume, pretty sure you guys will love it and it's not that hard to actually accomplish just about five minutes of your time just waiting to, till you get kicked out actually all right guys so the very last thing that we got right here is another funny animation glitch so all you guys want to go ahead and do is go towards the yacht and just about when you guys are about to jump out from the rail right here you will you, you just want to go ahead and just cancel the animation you just want to go ahead and walk back a little bit or you just want to stop yourself from actually continuing jumping and just by simply doing that your character is just going to launch himself up in the air and then he's just going to revert back just like that it looks very weird and i'm pretty sure you're not supposed to do this but you can just try it out with your friends and see how you can break the game actually Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, support it by dropping that blue thumbs up. You'll be ever so much appreciative. And as well, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. See you guys later. Peace out and stay safe everybody.